My name is Walter Unglob, and this is how to find the ratio of areas in a trapezoid. So here I have a trapezoid with a base B and two different heights. Let's call them H1 and H2. I notice that there's just one area inside of the trapezoid. So if I want to find a ratio of areas inside of the trapezoid, then I can simply just divide up the area into two separate areas. So now my original geometric figure is actually now two different figures. I have a rectangle with an area A1 and a right triangle right on top of the rectangle with an area 2. So I have two areas here and I can ask the question, what is the ratio of A1 over A2? To answer this question, we first need to calculate what these two areas are. So for the rectangle, I have simply A1 is equal to the base times the height of the rectangle. So I have B times H2. For the second area, which is the area of the triangle, I can use the triangle area formula, which is equal to 1 half times the base of the triangle times the height of the triangle. So I have 1 half times the base. That's easy. But then we want to calculate what this height of this triangle is. And we see that we can write it in terms of these two heights. It's merely the difference between H1 and H2. So I have B over 2 times H1 minus H2. Now that I have equations for both areas, I can divide these equations and calculate a ratio for the areas inside of the trapezoid. Thus, I have A1 divided A2 is equal to B times H2 divided by B divided 2 times H1 minus H2. I can simplify this by noticing that the base cancels out and I ultimately get 2 H2 divided by H1 minus H2. Thus, I have calculated the ratio of areas inside of this trapezoid. My name is Walter Unglob, and this is how to find the ratio of areas in a trapezoid.